That was Zabar heavy. Das. Such a heavy left overhand to the face of Sagar. Non-stop. Look, ground and pound non-stop. Dinesh is a machine. Ki tarah maar rahe Body. I'm going to tell him, Aur stand up. Mount lete huye almost. Ah, excellent defense here. Excellent defense. Bohat Explosive. So powerful. Last time at MFN 10, we saw Dinesh Naurim fight. Ladies and gentlemen, making his way to the cage, Dinesh Naurim! Dinesh Naurim is fighting MFN 11 ke cage. He was fighting in his last fight. Jeete the ye. अरसेंबा उजुकुम के खिलाफ इन्होंने लड़ाई करी थी और जीत के आए थे उस फाइट को तो आज यहाँ काफी ऊंचा मनोबल लेके आ रहे हैं So let's look at the keys to victory for Dinesh Naurim. He's got ace wrestling skills. He's got some powerful takedowns and he's got devastating shot strikes. So John, we saw Dinesh. Fight at MFN 10, and that was a game changer. You know, he just changed the game. Probably in the, in the second round, that was. He fought. He fought Arsenba. Yes, Arsenba was tearing him up in that first round, but once he got on top of him, he absolutely destroyed him. Arsenba ended up having to have facial reconstructive surgery. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I read about it. Now Dinesh Naurim also was picked up from MFN contenders. Prior to MFN contenders, he was fighting a lot of. World Championships, but was nothing happening, and then he fought at MFN Contenders. Now he is here at MFN 11. And his opponent, making his way to the cage, Sagar Thapa! Damn! I've been waiting to watch this guy fight. I've been, I, I saw a lot of his amateur fights. And John, you'll be amazed to know that Sagar was the first guy in the country to pull a twister in an amateur fight. Let's see if he can pull that off tonight. He certainly has his hands full. Sagar Thapa comes in representing Mutant MMA all the way from Uttarakhand. And for this specific bout, he ran his camp at Soma MMA in Bali. Let's look at his keys to victory. He's technically sharp. He attacks the body. And he's got some good transitions on the ground. As I said, he was the first one to pull a twister in amateur MMA in the country. Manan, this, this fight is going to be really technical and exciting because Dinesh is the wrestler. And on the other hand, we've got Sagar Thapa, who's got excellent jiu-jitsu. I love stylistic matchups like this, Raul. You've got a wrestler versus jiu-jitsu, a boxer versus a kickboxer. We always wonder which which art is better. I guess we'll find out tonight. I've got my own reservations for jiu-jitsu. I think jiu-jitsu is better. I think it's really dependent on the athletes, but We'll see tonight. Let's look at the tail of the tape. We've got Dinesh Naurim, 24 years of age, 161 centimeters in terms of height. He missed a bit of weight yesterday, weighing in at 57 kilograms and 250 grams. His style is wrestling. On the other hand, we've got Sagar Thapa, two years younger to Dinesh Naurim, 22 years of age. He's got a bit of height and reach advantage with 170, 174 centimeters as his height. He made weight yesterday, 56.6 kilograms. And his style is MMA. Ladies and gentlemen, first we introduce the blue corner. He weighed in at 57.25 kilograms, representing Manipur, Dinesh Naram. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, he weighed in at 56.6 kilograms, Representing Uttarakhand, Sagar Thapa! 
Ladies and gentlemen, the referee for the fight, Jakub. Follow my all instruction, all time. Clean fight, start to start and stop to immediately fight stop. Okay? Gloves touch. Gloves touch. Touch gloves. Go back. We've got a lot of fight fans in, atten in attendance here. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome once again. This is Matrix Fight Night 11. Ek body zabardast flyweight mukabla hamare samne hai. Dinesh Naurim versus Sagar Thapa. Dinesh hai Manipur se, Sagar hai Uttarakhand se. Dinesh uh, white and blue trunks mein. Sagar black and blue trunks mein. Dono fighters samay lete huye. Sagar ne ek leg kick se kari shuruat. Yeah, guys, these wide stances like this, they're great at preventing a takedown, but they certainly leave you open for nice hard leg kicks. Well, well Dinesh Kang pe aur dusri lagai body pe, bahut badiya combination Sagar ki taraf se. Well, John, Dinesh has to be a bit cautious here because Sagar definitely has that reach advantage. And especially with that big stance, Dinesh is making himself vulnerable for, this key, for those kicks. Guys, and to go back to these kicks, we need fighters to start blocking the kicks. All Bilkul fighters. John, we have not fighter ko abhi tak dekha hai in kicks. Ko check karte hue. We've not seen a single shin check. And it's actually been a common thing throughout the last three fights. MFN 9, 10 and 11. Ladies and gentlemen, that's some free coaching for, from John Groves right there. Start checking those leg kicks. Please. If Big John says start checking the legs, sorry, start <laughs> checking the kicks, you better do so. Both these guys. Oh! Dinesh shoots in. For a oh my goodness, that was crazy, man. Badi Badiya slam kiya yahan pe aur Dinesh aaye hain top pe. Bilkul samay nahi waste kar rahe hain. Aate hi do mukke lagaye. Body ko target kar rahe hain. Guys, one thing to notice here is Sagar is maintaining composure and staying calm even though he just got picked up and slammed on his head. Ye dekhiye, pressure dalte hue Dinesh Sagar ke upar punches laga rahe hain, elbow bhi lagai wahan pe. Bahut badiya domination. Dinesh doing a really good job here of controlling the hips, preventing Sagar from climbing that cage while raining down those punches from top position. Sagar is back up on his feet now. And Dinesh looking to take him down again. That's some crazy wrestling by Dinesh Naurin. Sagar again down. Mauka hi nahi de rahe hain Dinesh Sagar ko khade hone ka aur kuch apna game plan karne ka. Yahaan bar bar unko niche leke ja rahe hain aur dominate kar rahe hain. Filhaal dono fighter wapis apne pehron pe. Both fighters trading knees on and off the cage here. Dinesh doing a great job with these level changes and taking down Sagar here, kind of at will. Ye tisra takedown hai jo Dinesh ne liya hai. Bilkul apna man bana ke aaye hai ki niche rakhna hai Sagar ko aur bar bar takedown leke wohi kar rahe hai. Excellent wrestling by Dinesh Naurim here. I think that, that wrestling, that those takedowns, John, play to his, to his advantage. I agree with that. I agree with that wholeheartedly. And then he's always landing in side control. Notice once he sets Sagar down, he immediately is in side control, controlling his hips and controlling his shoulders. Bilkul control bahut milta hai aur dusri cheez striking bhi kar rahe hain. Ye dekhiye elbow lagai, punches laga rahe hain. Samay zaya nahi karte hain. Pura time, jitna time unhe ground pe milta hai, sara use karte hain. Aur shayad yahan pe guillotine lagane ki koshish Well, Sagar knows for sure that it's it's better they, they stand up and trade shots. Going to the ground may not be the best thing to do. Sagar's going to need to start utilizing that lead hand and stuff. Every time he comes in, keep it in his face. Keep him at bay, utilizing that nice stiff jab.
both these guys on the feet once again. And look at John, look at the way Dinesh is there. He's, he wants to shoot him once again. Take he, Sagar down. He does 100%. And he's continually faking that level change, throwing hands to Oh, oh he Whoa. was rocked right there. Nice uppercut by Sagar. And I think Sagar has to follow up with, with his shots. He literally. Oh! Nice head kick by Sagar here, right to the face. अब सागर ने अपनी तरफ से कुछ स्ट्राइक्स लैंड करने शुरू किए बहुत जरूरत भी थी सागर को इसकी क्योंकि पूरा राउंड जा रहा था दिनेश की तरफ ये अंत में जो एक दो अच्छे स्ट्राइक्स लैंड किए इससे बहुत फर्क पड़ेगा टेन मोर सेकंड्स टू गो ओह सागर अटैकिंग द बॉडी व्हाट अ राउंड व्हाट अ राउंड वन एक तरफा डोमिनेशन हो रही थी शुरुआत में लेकिन अंत में एक दो अच्छे स्ट्राइक्स लगा के सागर ने अपनी भी छाप छोड़ी इस फाइट में ये देखिए यहां से हुई शुरुआत दिनेश गए टेकडाउन के लिए बहुत बढ़िया तरीके से स्लैम करने के बाद कंट्रोल किया उन्होंने सागर को स्ट्राइक्स मारे पंचेस मारे एल्बोज मारी और जैसे ही सागर खड़े होते थे दिनेश वापस एक और टेकडाउन लगा के फाइट को ग्राउंड पे ले जाते गए और ग्राउंड पे किया उन्होंने डोमिनेट लेकिन यहां सागर ने भी एक बढ़िया पंच लगाया और एक अच्छी किक लॉट ऑफ फाइट फैंस इन अटेंडेंस हियर लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन दिस इज मेट्रिक्स फाइट नाइट 11 वी आर लाइव ऑल द वे फ्रॉम न्यू दिल्ली एक्सक्लूसिवली इन द कंट्री ओनली ऑन डिज्नी हॉटस्टार सैंक्शन किया है मैट्रिक्स फाइट नाइट 11 को गैमएफ ने ग्लोबल एसोसिएशन ऑफ मिक्स मार्शल आर्ट्स फेडरेशन एज वेल एज ऑल इंडिया मिक्स मार्शल आर्ट्स एसोसिएशन राउंड नंबर टू बिगिन्स बोथ दिस गाइस ऑन देयर फीट ट्राइंग टू असेस द डिस्टेंस आ व्हाट अ स्प्रॉल मैन दिस इज क्रेजी सागर नोस दिनेश विल बी शूटिंग इन एंड ही बेटर बी स्प्रॉलिंग और यहां पे दिनेश को पोजीशन मिल गई है अपनी टॉप पोजीशन में है पंचेस लगा रहे हैं डोमिनेट कर रहे हैं यही चाहते हैं दिनेश फाइट को ग्राउंड पे लेके जाना इसलिए हमने देखा राउंड शुरू होते ही दिनेश सीधा टेक डाउन के लिए गए हालांकि पहला टेक डाउन डिफेंड किया सागर ने दूसरा नहीं कर पाए Both these guys trading shots while on the ground. Dinesh trying in for top domination. He may have good wrestling skills, but trust me, I trust Sagar's jiu-jitsu more. I really like the way Dinesh is uh, punching Sagar. He's going body head, body head. He's mixing it up. This is classic ground and pound. Fantastic work from Dinesh. Very much reminiscent of Mark Coleman back in the day. Wow! Look at those punches. बहुत ताकत है. Every punch But has a lot of power in it. Manan, I think Dinesh is uh, sorry. Sagar is working on something. He, you know, with Dinesh punching him, there's enough room for him to pull a to try and pull a triangle. Rahul, it's like Mike Tyson said. Everybody has a plan till they get hit in the face. Yeah. Such I a agree. true story. Never gets old. नॉन स्टॉप देखिए ग्राउंड एंड पाउंड नॉन स्टॉप है दिनेश एक मशीन की तरह मार रहे हैं बॉडी हेड बॉडी हेड नॉन स्टॉप प्रेशर डाल रहे हैं यू नो ही इज नॉट इवन वेरी कंसर्न विद पासिंग द गार्ड ही जस्ट वांट्स टू कीप थ्रोइंग दोस पंचेस ही हैज इनक्रेडिबल टॉप प्रेशर हियर दिनेश इफ आई एम सागर एंड सागर्स कैंप आई एम गोइंग टू टेल हिम और अब यहां माउंट लेते हुए ऑलमोस्ट आ एक्सीलेंट डिफेंस हियर एक्सीलेंट डिफेंस He didn't, he didn't let Dinesh take the mount. Slipped right out of the back door and right back into full guard. I'm impressed by Sagar's jiu-jitsu. Dinesh again on top. Well, Sagar here could could do something with his with his legs. Maybe setting up a a submission. He's got the guard open now. He closes again. But one thing, oh man! Nice short elbow opens up a cut on Sagar's toxic. forehead. Super toxic and vicious. 
And one more. Oh man, that's nasty. The that's referee calls nasty. for a timeout. I think I think it's because the referee wants the doctors to check on Sagar. Itni zada vicious thi wo elbow ki referee ko timeout call karna pada. Well, this that is exactly what Dinesh did at MFN 10. You know, that was the kind of cuts and bruises that Arsen Bagot were absolutely crazy. Yes, he is certainly not someone that you want on top of you. These short little elbows open you up, and he's just able to create so much damage. Yeah, if after one of those elbows, the referee has to call a timeout, that says a lot about the power of those elbows. Dinesh talking to his corner. Rahul, I would say Dinesh is able to completely implement his strategy here. He wanted to come in, take Sagar down, and then dominate him on the ground, which is what has been happening right from the beginning of the fight. All right, so Sagar is back. Doctors checked him. He's good to go, good to fight, and the action begins. This is round number two. We've got less than two minutes to go. Excellent. Action by Dinesh Nawram here. Now, oh. with the, now with the giant cut on his head, he's really going to need to not get taken down. He cannot afford any more punishment on the ground from Dinesh. Oh, that is solid. That was Zabartas. heavy. Such a heavy left overhand to the face of Sagar. Oh, another. Us overhand ke piche take down chupate hue Dinesh ne kari entry. बिल्कुल समान समय नहीं जाया कर रहे हैं टेक डाउन लेते ही स्ट्राइकिंग कर दी है चालू दिनेश ने एक मिनट अभी भी पड़ा है इस राउंड में दिनेश अगेन डोमिनेटिंग सागर फ्रॉम द टॉप ही इज रिलेंटलेस ही इज स्ट्राइकिंग ऑफ दिनेश डूइंग अ रियली गुड जॉब बहुत ही खतरनाक पोजीशन गाइस अभी 40 सेकंड पड़े हैं फाइट खत्म भी हो सकती है रेफरी या को बहुत ध्यान से देखते हुए और दोनों फाइटर वापस अब अपने पैरों पे Dinesh has done some serious damage to Sagar. Look at Sagar's face. And Dinesh looks absolutely unscarred, unscratched. Oh, another takedown. Man. Yeah, it's like this a machine. Is, yes, it, it, has it does to be, the same thing again and again and again. And there's no stopping it. Dinesh is like a machine. He won't let you stand up, man. He won't let you stand up. I want you guys to notice as well. He does a very good job of targeting that cut on Sagar's face. Every time he gets an opportunity to strike it, he strike and strikes it and opens it up just a little bit further. Ten more seconds to go. Solid and ground and pound. I'm really impressed with Dinesh's ground and pound. John, this man is a beast. Continuous pounding. He's like being hit by a Mack truck, guys. <laughs> Dinesh back to his corner. Sagar kind of lost here. I think he got rocked. That's Sagar. Let's look at the highlights. Ye take down defense acha kiya tha Sagar ne. Lekin iske baad koi bhi take down wo defend nahi kar paye. Baar baar Dinesh leke gaye Sagar ko ground pe aur jaise hi ground pe le jaate the mukkon ki barish, elbows, pure domination. Well, that's the stoppage in in the second round, and that's the pounding by Dinesh. बिल्कुल ही relentless तरीके से Dinesh ने dominate किया है फिलहाल इस fight को. And Malan, look at the way you know. Dinesh here looks unscratched. He doesn't even have a a scratch on his body. On the contrary, we've got Sagar Thapa, who's been battered badly by Dinesh. एक तरफा fight चल रही है Rahul. हम शुरुआत से देख रहे हैं Dinesh आते हैं, take down लेते हैं और तोड़ते हैं अपने opponent को और उसी चीज का repeat हमें बार-बार देखने को मिल रहा है and you'll see it happening again. Punches मारेंगे, kicks मारेंगे. He'll hide his take down behind some strikes, which is very intelligent. 
and then he'll repeat what he's been doing in the previous two rounds. Hey, if it's not broke, why fix it? I 100% agree with that, John. Dinesh, again, setting up a takedown, throws in a kick. Oh! Sagar counter strikes. Oh! Man, that that's landed some clean heavy on leather. the jaw. There we go again, guys. As soon as Dinesh gets Sagar on his back foot, he immediately shoots in for that singular double leg and takes him down to the canvas. And he doesn't leave Dinesh. If you defend one takedown, he immediately puts the other one behind him. He puts the chain behind him. He puts the chain behind him. He puts the chain behind him. Very intelligent strategy. He puts the chain behind him. And here, he puts the chain behind him. He puts the chain behind him. Both these guys up on the feet once again. But Dinesh has been dominating Sagar. Oh! An attempt to take the back. Very he solid knee strike lagaya wahan pe Dinesh ne. And if you notice guys, Sagar seems to be sort of worn out now. Sagar is certainly worn out guys. He's been taking a beating for the last two rounds. No action we get to see from Sagar. No punches, no kicks. Guys, I think that liver kick right there hurt him. You see how he went from holding his hands up high, now his elbow is down by his liver. That hurt. I think that was a leg check right there, guys. Another takedown. John, I like the way Dinesh has been planning his takedowns. You know, he, he, he kicks you, he punches you, but eventually takes you down. Bohati khatre mein Sagar Thapa. Non-stop hammer strikes. And the referee has stopped the fight. Dinesh Naurem wins via TKO. What a performance, ladies and gentlemen. Excellent stoppage here by the referee. Excellent stoppage. I agree with that stoppage 100%. Unstoppable. Just the way that Dinesh has fought. Unstoppable. In his strategy. Unstoppable in his takedowns. ये देखिए ये हुआ फिनिश हैमर स्ट्राइक्स मार रहे हैं सागर बिल्कुल ही हेल्पलेस लग रहे हैं यहाँ पे और रेफरी ने बहुत ही अच्छा निर्णय लिया इस फाइट को रोकने का। I can I can tell you that if he continues to develop the way he is, we might be looking at a future champion. I would, however, like to see him fight against somebody who's better at defending takedowns or maybe they have their own ground game to deal with. I agree with that, Manan. But so far, a truly fantastic performance from Dinesh Naurim. John, it's, it's exciting to see that Dinesh comes in from Warrior School of MMA. They've got five fighters fighting on the card today and they've got three wins so far. Let's go over to Janet for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, Ref Yakub called the stop to the fight and in the third round, declaring the winner by TKO, Dinesh Naram! Dinesh, you can also take your coach if you want to come to your coach, but... Dinesh, what a great performance. Thank you. First of all, thank you. I want to say thank you. Because I had a chance to play with me. I want to say thank you. I was listening to my brain. I didn't think anything. Yes, I'm talking a lot. I don't have a lot of strength and I don't have a lot of strength. I also said that. I have taught everything. I am a strong guy. I am a very strong guy. टीम सबसे पहले मेरे को एमएफएल एमएमए खेलने के लिए मौका दिया रोशन माइनम उसको थैंक यू बोलना चाहता हूँ और बनीपुर का सब मेरे गांव का सब लोगों को सबको थैंक यू बोलना चाहता हूँ मेरे तो कुछ नहीं आता सब ने सिखाया इसीलिए वजह से मैं अभी जीने का मौका मिला थैंक यू मेरा कोच थैंक यू हॉरिस को एम एफ एल सबको थैंक यू बोलना चाहता हूँ और एक चीज़ और मैं टू 
फोर्टीन से आज तक मेरे को हेल्प किया एक आदमी इधर आया था उसका नाम पोछम गुम विद्या रानी वो रेस्लर है सब जूनियर में उसको ब्रोंज पे हार गया था वो देख के मेरे को मैं भी इंटरनेशनल लेवल पे खेलूंगा वो से उसके ट्राई किया मैंने उसको प्रपोज किया मारा एक साल लगा था उसको प्रपोज उसने अभी तक हेल्प किया था वो अभी आई टी पी में था वो भी रेस्लर है वो नेशनल सब जूनियर से अभी शनिवार तक कंटिन्यू मेडल आया उसका वो भी थैंक यू बोलना चाहता हूँ वेल आप ऐसे हार्ड वर्क करेंगे और एम एफ एन के सपोर्ट के साथ आप 100 परसेंट इंटरनेशनल खेलोगे आप मुझे कोच से भी क्वेश्चन पूछना है ऑफ कोर्स आई थिंक लाइक यू मैंशन यू बिन वर्किंग ऑन हिज मेंटल गेम इज वेल सो टेल अस द इम्प्लीमेंटेशन यू बिन डूइंग ऑन हिम आई मीन ही गॉट रॉक इन द फर्स्ट राउंड केम बैक फ्रॉम इट सो ग्रेट जॉब इज दैट ऑल आई कैन से फॉर नाउ आई मीन ही गुड जॉब We still have two fights to go. Let's see how the night goes. All right. Well, that's all happy and smiling faces from this camp. Congratulations, Nation. Good luck.